Hey guys, you guys are probably wondering why I'm standing by a bunch of uh, random stuff in a destroyed Goodman heat pump. Well, got some uh, pretty big news for the very, very, very near future. Um, my guy that I'm gonna be working with, he texted me saying he's got the mini split heat pumps ordered. He's gonna go pick them up on Monday. Uh, I'm not quite sure when they'll be installed, probably a couple days after that. And also, let's see how many of you guys remember these things, the Arco Airs. Um, yep, and there's the furnaces. These are back in the equation. We could just possibly put many split heat pumps and the uh, Arco Airs in here. We'd use one of the arco wares for the downstairs like the right now there's three floors i'm on the third floor as you can see all the you know the the ceiling and everything um so we use one for the first floor which is where you walk in at that's a little shop my dad works there um so we'd put a three ton air conditioner in with a three ton gas furnace and we'd use the second one for the main area on the second floor. As you can see right there, this uh, whole area, it extends all the way down to there. Just that whole area, we'd use a three ton um, AC and another gas furnace. I hate those things. Um, and then we'd use the mini splits for two rooms which i can go and show you right now so up there is where i just was here is one of the two two rooms <clears throat> excuse me that will be uh getting the mini split i'm gonna put a two and a half ton in here i believe right now we're just using these heaters we've used them for years as you can see they're falling apart <laughs> um so we'd put the outdoor units on behind this wall. This is the second floor. You can open these doors and look down. Um, put them out there. We'd probably put the indoor units. One there and maybe one there. I'm not quite sure yet. And then in here, the other room, it's similar size. I mean, right now it is freezing in here. So I got this jacket on. Here's the other room, the gym. Similar in size. This one we're going to put a three ton in. So when we open those doors, some of it will, uh, the, the, um, the heat or AC, whatever, uh, it'll go in here. It'll blow from in there to in here. But uh, the only thing that doesn't make sense to me while I said that is if we do end up putting the Arco Airs in here, it's going to cause some problems because it's a three ton condenser out there and a three ton mini split in here be more 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 than enough capacity so i guess we just keep these door closed doors closed now that i think about it but then that would be too big for in here probably need a two or two and a half ton in here i don't, I don't know we'll, we'll figure it out but at the mini splits ordered so everything is purchased so we'll, we'll uh We'll see. Keep you guys updated. They sh uh, most likely will be, the mini switch will most likely be installed uh, before the end of the winter. Because I wouldn't imagine we'd order them and we'd be sitting up there for two and a half years. Tell they haven't done that before. The Arco Airs. Um, anyways, just thought I'd show you guys that. Anyways, just thought I'd show you guys that and keep you guys updated on everything I know we've been talking about putting AC in here since literally the beginning of my channel I was on YouTube for about two months and we were already uh, the Arco Air was sitting right there brand new and now they're sitting up there still brand new all right anyways just thought I'd let you guys know thanks for watching just for the heck of it thought I'd include the mighty duo. Couple months.
we'll hear this thing's um, first startup for 2024. Wonder if it'll sound as rough as Mr. Lennox over here. Breaks the whole house. I am planning on preserving this top logo. Right now it's just wet. Not fading yet. Could have done a bit better on the brazing. I mean, it hasn't leaked yet, but guy was holding the brazing rod by the very end and I mean hey it worked but I prefer not like close to the joint but you know, right here so you can get some leverage but you can see this is the new copper this is the existing copper right here until up until this joint right here then it goes straight to the unit this one is 10 years old now or soon to be Hard to believe. I remember, I remember when house was being built. These things, the, this Lennox and the old unit here, are sitting here, not even installed yet. The lines are hooked in, but disconnects weren't a thing yet. Almost 10 years later, one of them's gone. and 22 ton and this one if you can read it 2014 three ton when we were building the house before we even started like construction on it we were at a meeting with the guy who's uh, the main guy who owned the company that was going to be building the house and of course me being me back then five years old I was like hey what kind of air conditioner we're gonna have and his exact words powered by Lennox and this house is still partly powered by Lennox also carrier now and then this thing goes whenever that is I would like to put a two-stage carrier performance dual fuel system here but we'll see time will tell anyway just thought I'd include that short little clip in the video all right stay tuned thanks for watching